not just scooters. Ola wants to power your home now. With Project Sakti, Bhavis Agarwal is now betting on India's energy storage market, estimated to be 30 billion US dollar by 2030. Some call it India's Tesla power well movement. Other complain, fix your scooters first. So is this Ola Sakti the future of battery energy storage in India? or just another marketing spin. Let's break it down. First, the big question. Kya Bhavi Sagarwal ab India ki ugly clean energy wave pakadna chaate hain? Ya phir ye Ola ke scooter business ki problem se dhyan hatane ki koshi se? Why does battery storage matter for India? Kya BESS, battery energy storage systems, India ke power gap ko bhar paayega? Rooftop se lekar electric vehicle tak, ye market hai 30 billion US dollar by 2030. What exactly is Ola promising with Project Sakti? An intelligent, portable, made in India energy system. But its features, timelines, and use cases are real? Hai? And finally, can Ola take on energy giants? When Reliance, Adani, and Tata Power are in storage, what is the value of Ola? What is the value of Ola? What is the value of Ola? scale or trust? Hi so now let's first look at you know the Ola Electric's hidden challenges you know in the scooter business are they undermining consumer trust that's the big issue when your core business is losing trust every new launch feels like a gamble but Ola insists Project Sakti is not a distraction it's a part of their long-term energy roadmap should we believe Ola let's look at some of the problem you know Ola scooter is facing of late one is the government scrutiny. Ministry's audit highlights service center issue. I mean, that's the big issue which the Ola scooter is facing. PLI timeline miss. Government question Ola's Gear Factory milestone. There has been a lot of delays on the uh, Gear Factory front. A warranty violation. Free repairs denied during warranty period. Again, that's a very big consumer issue. Now coming to repair and delays. Scooter stuck in service center for weeks. I mean, that's the big issue if somebody has bought a scooter. Second, scaled back ambitions, reduce battery capacity, you know, impacts confidence. Recently, they have reduced, uh, you know, the Giga factories, uh, you know, capacity plants. And finally, defective products. Court penalizes uh, Ola for defective scooters. I mean, these are very serious issues which the Ola has been facing. You know, in the last one two years with this project sakti uh, should we be giving ola the benefit of doubt number one startup often stumble before they achieve success her body tech company ki suruvat mein kuch growing pain jhelne padte hain kabhi supply chain ki dikkat to kabhi service network badhane ki muskil battery storage jaisa naya aur complex chhetra hai jo shuruati galtiyan hona failure nahi balik learning phase ka hi hissa hai second long term vision not sudden pivot reports ke mutabik Ola pehle se hi energy storage mein kadam rakhne ki yojana bana raha tha. Ye uske bade strategic roadmap ka hissa hai. Sirf scooter se dhyan hatana nahi. A investor presentation aur media report mein bhi Ola ne pehle kai baar ishara kiya tha ki wo battery manufacturing, cell R&D aur energy solution par bhi kaam kar raha hai. Number 3 leveraging existing strength. Ola ke paas pehle se hi ek mazboot aadhar hai. Battery cell manufacturing jo kai logo ke paas nahi hai. EV R&D based supply chain investors और एक मजबूत ब्रांड रीच इन सब के चलते ओला के लिए नया कदम किसी कोल्ड स्टार्ट जैसा नहीं है अगर वो इन ताकतों को सही तरह से जोड़ ले तो नए खिलाड़ियों से कहीं ज्यादा तेजी से आगे बढ़ सकता है एंड फाइनली इंडिया नीड स्टोरेज टाइमिंग इज राइट भारत में डिमांड सिग्नल बहुत मजबूत है रूफटॉप सोलर ईवी ग्रोथ और ग्रिड बैकअप सिस्टम की जरूरत तेजी से बढ़ रही है ऐसे में अगर ओला अभी कदम रखती है तो उसे कुछ क्षेत्रों में फर्स्ट मूवर एडवांटेज मिल सकता है जैसे घर के लिए बैटरी स्टोरेज मोबाइल पावर यूनिट्स और रूलर माइक्रो ग्रिड्स नाउ द सेकंड बिग क्वेश्चन इज व्हाई डज बैटरी स्टोरेज सिस्टम मैटर फॉर इंडिया और फॉर ओला और फॉर द इन्वेस्टर्स बीएसएस बैटरी एनर्जी स्टोरेज सिस्टम का मतलब बिजली का बैंक जब पावर एक्स्ट्रा हो उसे चार्ज करो और जब जरूरत पड़े इस्तेमाल करो Ola will be using its existing EV battery expertise and Gigafactory to power your home or small businesses. So now let's look at the market size. Uh, you know, if you look at the India's battery storage market, it is around 2000 crore. So it's a very small market as of today. But look at the growth. Future value by 2030 in the next five years is going to be 10,000 crore. And this is we are talking about the general, general you know, battery storage. Now let's come to Indian 
residential storage this is where uh, one of the area where you know the ola uh, is going to play current market size is very small 230 crores look at the by 2030 1000 crore the home and the small business battery system this is where this is what the ola is targeting in terms of the requirement target is 219 megawatt hours this is uh, 411 megawatt hour by 2030 but this figure is very important rupees 1000 crore market by 2030 in the next 5 year and, and ola is targeting that space but this is very important hai ki, you know building batteries is easy building trust safety and reliability at scale is the real challenge global players like tesla powerwall and byd face similar hurdles you know before consumer acceptance took off so number one is the battery life and degradation har baar jab battery charge or discharge hoti hai uski capacity thodi kam ho jati hai lambe samay tak acha performance dene ke liye zaruri hai achhi cell quality sahi cooling system aur ek smart battery management system number two safety and fire risk lithium ion batteries agar sahi tarike se manage na ki jaye तो वो ओवर हीट हो सकती हैं या फायर पकड़ सकती है इसलिए ओला को बहुत मजबूत थर्मल कंट्रोल सिस्टम सारे जरूरी सेफ्टी सर्टिफिकेशन और सबसे अहम यूजर्स ट्रस्ट बनाना होगा नंबर थ्री हाई अपफ्रंट कॉस्ट होम बीईएसएस सिस्टम्स काफी महंगे होते हैं और लोग चाहते हैं कि इन्वेस्टमेंट जल्दी वसूल हो जाए इसलिए सफलता इसी में है कि ओला इन्हें एफोर्डेबल प्राइस और अच्छे फाइनेंसिंग ऑप्शन या लीज मॉडल के साथ पेश करें and finally installation and service network hazaro chote chote installations ko badhana aasan nahi hota hai iske liye chahiye majboot logistic system aur acche se trained service partners yahi wo kshetra hai jahan ola ko apni pakad aur majboot karni hogi now let's look at what ola is promising with project sakti these are the promises and this is the reality check and key concerns number 1 hybrid uses works the battery works with both solar and grid power to store electricity for home and shops what are concern will it smoothly integrate with different inverters and grid standard i mean that's the big question installation challenges may arise in this case number 2 made in india tech uses ola's own bharat cells from his giga factory very good concern core materials like lithium are still imported full localization will take time number 3 portable and modular design this is what ola is claiming and promising compact plug and play expandable storage system was the concern real portability depends on weight which is very important and form form factor now 5 to 10 kilowatt hour units may be too heavy for homes fourth smart intelligent system app based monitoring and ai driven power optimization the concern is the reliability of software and app box and iot connectivity could affect user experience and finally multi use product one device for home small businesses and ev chargers what is the concern one size fits all may not deliver consistent output needs tailored versions so these are what all the ola is promising and reality check what are the key concern now let's look at the final chart can ola take on the big energy giants now tata power solar strong brand solar integration offering rooftop hybrid system excite industries it is already in the battery business for decades offering lithium and you know bess the battery energy storage system amar raj again for year i mean this is a company which has been in the battery space for decades battery manufacturing stationary storage ev packs luminous power power backup inverter and solar residential energy storage and there are host of other player like lg and all specialist risk global tech storage again energy solution they are also offering that then we have sterlight wari sterling and wilson reliable epc capability integrating bess in projects so the big player like reliance adani and tata power are building grid scale storage but not your home batteries yet their focus is upstream you know manufacturing or large scale storage but not retail that's where ola sakti can find its niche in residential and small business energy system you know the real competition for ola sakti will come from excite energy amar raja and the luminous which we have discussed in the chart and the new players like wari 
and servo tech as you can see ola is stepping out of scooter and entering your homes now with battery energy systems it's bold it's risky and it's bhavis being bhavis every failure seems to recharge his next big idea but will project sakti finally deliver the power he has been chasing all along just to make a disclaimer that i have investment in ola electric share and in case you plan to invest in ola i suggest do consult your financial advisor <laughs>